Thank you, Terry. Thank you. Oh, boy, you really took the turtle game by the tail, and you sort of, like, shelled your opposition. Have you ever owned a turtle, or do you want one? No. You don't want yet. a turtle? Why no. not? I don't know. Come on. I don't care. You don't care. How about you? You want a turtle? Yeah. You do? Mm -hmm. Terry? You've got a big checkbook. Okay. Well, anyway, well, 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 personally, I think turtles are best off in the wild doing their ninja kicks in the privacy of their own swamps. And speaking of swamps, you're moving into the power picks. Huh? You like the power picks, don't you? I see those smiles on your faces. Yeah. <laughs> Johnny, yeah, good. Okay, okay, I got five questions here. The first two and the music question are worth 10 points. The fourth question is worth 20 points. The fifth question is not worth no points at all. It is worth this. You win Conan. Oh, yeah. You happy? Yeah. You want to win this? Yeah. Do you want to win this? Yeah. Well, so do I. Okay, great. Here we go. Question number one coming to you. Don't be nervous, guys. Don't be nervous. Calm, calm. Look at this guy. He's like... <laughs> yes? <laughs> what is it? What's the answer? You buzzed in. <laughs> Get Chaz. Uh, he's, he's no, no, no. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Question number one. If an unscrupulous French chef came along, overpowered the turtles, and made turtle leg and arm soup, how many legs and arms would the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles provide for his broth? Yes. Four. Four is incorrect. I shall repeat the question and the three multiple choice answers oh all for God. you there, buddy. So don't buzz in until you hear everything, okay? You're at ease here. If an unscrupulous French chef came along, overpowered the turtles, and made turtle leg and arm soup, how many legs and arms would the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles provide for his broth? A, a don't... Oh, sorry. Yes? Fourteen. 14 is incorrect. The correct answer was A, 16. You should have listened to everything. You shouldn't have buzzed in. So this 10 points goes to Chaz and Patrick. You guys did a great job. Here we go. Quick. Oh, you like them, don't you? Is that what you're going? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Question number two. For 10 points, if you had to put the Ninja Turtles names in alphabetical order, please, guys, please, I'll, I'll, I'll repeat it. Concentrate. For 10 points, if you had to put the Ninja Turtles names in alphabetical order, whose name would be first and whose name would be last? Yes, Chris. Leonardo first, and Raphael last. Ah, uh, that is incorrect. Okay, the, the question, the question once again, and the three multiple choice answers for you, bud. Here we go. If you had to put the Ninja Turtles' names in alphabetical order, whose names would be first and whose name would be last? A, Donatello Raphael, B, Donatello Leonardo, or C, Groucho and Zeppo? Yes. A. A is correct, and the 10 points are yours. Jason, huh? Yeah, huh? Yeah. Anchovies. The, oh, no anchovies. He wants anchovies. No. You, you don't want anchovies. No. Great. Oh, hey, video power. Cool. All right, here we go. Question number three. You guys like music? Into music? Cheer up, yeah. buddy. Cheer up, cheer up. You're doing a great job. Here we go. Play some tunes, band, and you name it. That's ten points for you. Go! <laughs> yeah! Ninja Gaiden. Ninja Gaiden is incorrect. Play a little bit more in the three multiple choice answers. Don't you buzz in until you hear everything. Is it A, Batman, B, Super Mario Brothers 3, or C, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 1? Yes. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 1. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 1 is correct. And the 10 pizza points are yours. Yeah. Jason. Ah, ah, ah. Are you into Friday the 13th? You like those films? Ah, ah. Uh, no, okay. <laughs> Scared, huh? Okay, if you defeat Vincent Van Grau in the house of Shogun, he turns into something. What does he turn into? Yes. Fire. Fire. Flame is correct. And... The 20 points are yours. Look at this guy. He's racking up everything. Here we go. Here we go. Fifth question. This is worth that Conan tape. So look over here with me. Okay. Now, in a, name the uh, the game you see on the screen, and it's the Conan for you. So hit it, Chris. Is it A, Quantum Fighter, B, Quicks, or C, yes? Quicks. Quicks is correct. And Conan is yours. Enjoy, bud. Okay, let's add up these scores. We've got 20, 30, 40. We've got a Conan tape. This man is the video power picks leader. Let's hear it for a Jason and Chris. Oh, you guys are doing great. Before the pressure gets so bad that the hair shoots out of your heads at the speed of sound, shake his hand, buddy. All right, great. Well, let's go to some commercial ads, and uh, they're pretty appealing, Neeling. We'll be right back. Video Power will be right back. Pax had created the ultimate football video game. Because I control Joe Montana. Wait. I control his strategy. Hike, 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 stop. Game Gear already does that. 
It's a lie. It's true. Call play Scramble Pass and Score with Joe Montana Football on Game Gear. But mine's also a color TV. And this optional TV tuner turns Game Gear into a color TV. Good pass. Nice reception, too. Game Gear from Sega. Go dweeb to trap my toxic sludge dump. I'll get one with this scuttlecopter. Here she comes, sludge. Oh no! I need Captain Planet! I'll save you, Gee. You miss me, scum. Yeah, I guess we made a mess out of their plans. The power is yours! Now there's a cool place to get the flavor of apples and cinnamon. <laughs> New apple cinnamon pop tarts from Kellogg's. Big apple taste with a touch of cinnamon that'll knock you out. How you doing back there, guys? Good to see you. Oh, hey, there you are, Ranger Charlie. I've been looking everywhere oh, for I'm you. Oh, I'm just hanging out with some friends, Roscoe. Oh, that's great. You got friends every shape, size, and color there. Yep, oh. and there's something special about each and every one of them. Oh. See, like Rick here, he's really good at telling funny jokes. <laughs> and Wendy likes to help people. And Crystal, she's an excellent whistler. Wow, Ranger Charlie, you see something good in everybody. Yeah, it's not what's outside that counts, it's what's inside that matters. Right. We, we care, care about, about you. you. And now, more video power. Take a shot. Oh, yeah. Hey, take one, take one, take one. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. go, 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 go. Yes, Dunk! Oh, yeah, we are back, and just in time, because these guys are through with all the pre-game hype and sideshow promotions. They want to get right down to business. Am I right? You want to yeah. get down to business? Yes, 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 yes. And I am going to let them right after this. There are 50 points to the winner here. Okay, Chris? 50 points, and no points to the loser, because it's whiner take all. Okay, guys, you've got 61 seconds to play Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. You familiar with that game? Of course you are. You just played it about, uh, what, five minutes ago? Okay. Okay, well, so if you've ever had anything to prove to anyone ever before, now is the time to prove it. Okay, on your marks, good luck to the both of you. Watch me, please. You know what to do there, Jace. Turn around. Go. You know, you know. Uh, yeah, okay, that's great. On your mark, get set, go! One-on-one -on, -one on the clock, and it's one-on-one -on -one in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2. We're taking you way up to level four. Now, this is Chris. He is taken on with uh, Michelangelo and Leonardo. Now, both of these guys are watching the same identical screen. It's head-to-head -head competition, and that's what Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2 allows you to in this game. You see Chris has got Michelangelo at five points, and now check out Jason. He has got seven points now with Leonardo. Jason taking a slight lead over Chris, but Chris is coming back and playing hard. Both these guys are on the screen. You're watching over the shoulder of Jason currently. Jason coming in there with seven points now, two-point lead. Jason and Leonardo, a good team, and it's working out well. Again, they're in Central Park in level four here. <laughs> you got to watch out for these uh, Frosty, the uh, hitman here, and they are taking the out in Central Park in the middle of winter, and this is tough. Leonardo and Jason coming in now at eight points. Check it out. Chris coming in. Will he come back in time? He's got seven points now. Chris is finally back in the race, but will he do it in time? As you see, time is ticking away. We'll ask down to those last final seconds. Everything counts in this race. Oh, that's as close as it gets. Jason coming in there at nine points. Couldn't quite pull it off in time. Chris came in there last minute effort with eight points. The big winner this round goes to... Chris drops out. Jason is in. Yes. Jason, you have a 50-star point. Where am I going to put it? Where do you want me to put it? Right there. Bam. Okay, you got it. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Huh, Jason is the Video Power Challenge champion. Let's hear it for him. Terry, Terry. Come on, let's hear it for him. Terry, take it away there, buddy. Well, I got to tell you, some of our departing guests earlier will take away lots of prizes like Ninja Guide N2. They'll take away uh, Game Boy and an East Pack and lots of other prizes for those guys and for you, some promotional considerations. Nico radio-controlled Ferrari Tessarossa. This high-performance racer features authentic style precision road handling up to 15 miles per hour from Nico America Incorporated. NTVIC's fastest lap for Game Boy featuring F1 action on 16 raceways of the international circuit. You can build a different high-speed car for each and every track. Hit the pavement, that's fastest lap. Wardrobe for Video Power and Johnny Arcade provided by Introspect Guys, where you can make a statement with Introspect. Hey, 
Come on over here, you big winners. Woo. Hey, a little bit of pressure there in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Is that one of your favorite games? Yeah. Yeah, well, you did good, and we got some great prizes for you. Johnny, what do we got? Okay, Chris, we have got a video-powered jacket for you there, buddy, and Game Gear Super Monaco GP. Slip this on. Slip it on, slip it on, slip it on. Just like that. Oh, yeah, there we go. Uh, my cost, uh, okay, your cost is this way. All right, come on over here, Jason. Man, big winner. You pulled it off just in time there. A lot of pressure. You ready for the big run? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, here's what you got to look for. If he finds this game in the mall today, Jason, I'm going to give you a little clue. It's right around the door, number one, okay? Paper Boy, Game Boy, look for it. If you find it, we got a huge prize. Check it out. You will take home a Game Boy and an East Pack. It'll all be yours. All right, Jason, let the run begin. Here we go. At five, four, three, two, one. It's begun as he starts to run. He's underway in the mall today as he takes to the top. Look at this guy shop. Now he's got to move right down the line. He's sticking those prizes to his head as he Velcros those values along the way. Well, he didn't grab my coffee cup. That's good news. Working his way down, he's picking out some of his favorite games. Now he's got to start heading for the top as he starts to shop around the corner there. All right, buddy, you better head for the top. You don't have much time as he takes it on the back. A pack on the back, indeed, as he head through the mouse hole. Didn't time. Yes, he'll shoot the tube and head to the top. Now, just 10 seconds left to go. On the row, he takes... And those are some of the valuable prizes there. He passes up a couple of games, grabs some Nintendo games there. Last second of play, he didn't get the secret prize, and he is coming down in time. Yes! Oh, man, good thing you had that East Pack to cushion yourself there. Jason, hang right there, man. Don't go away. I know this guy's got to be worn out. Check out his big prizes in the winner's circle. He takes home Penguin Wars Game Boy, prize number one. Yeah. How about it for Flying Warriors? He'll take home Pinball Quest. He'll take home Ninja Crusaders. Disney DuckTales. American Gladiators. Good pick. Total Recall. Chippendale Rescue Rangers. Bad News Baseball. You're not leaving, are you? Are you annoyed? Check it out. Ishido, he's helping me shop here. He's got a heavy shredding, and you got some family. Come on over here, Mom. And, of course, Batman, a great take today. Here's our big winner. He's coming back for the Big Friday Show. Way to go, Video Power. Hey, buds. If you want me to do some tips from your favorite video games, or you just want to appear on the show, write to me in five words or more and tell me why you think you should be a contestant on the greatest video game show in the universe, Video Power. Just write to Video Power, P.O. Box 896, Madison Square Station, New York, New York, 10159. Video Power is not affiliated with the manufacturers of any video game system or product. It does not recommend or promote any particular video game system or product. Hey, who's the dude that gets all the girls? Who's the dude who saves the world? And who's the dude with all the good looks? No, sillies, I'm not talking about me. It's James Bond Jr. next on KCW TV 11. Woo!